Hello and welcome to a very quick video about this thing here. This is the R8 receiver from Jumper. Now this was a receiver I wasn't particularly interested in. I have lots of X8Rs from FreeSky hanging around that I use with D16 mode with my radios. Now over the past couple of weeks I've been looking at these Jumper receivers as I've heard some really good things. And I've had a couple in now and I've been playing with them and I too am really impressed. But I want to show you one really cool feature that these things do. Now if you've been watching the channel a lot over the past couple of years, you'll have spotted that I do an awful lot with Ardu Pilot. That's either Ardu Plane, Ardu Copter, with Pix Hawks, Maytech boards, lots of different things. And one of the things that you have to do to be able to get the telemetry down from the model into your radio to use something like the Yapu script is you need an extra little cable. And this little cable is something that you can either buy places like eBay, or you can make one relatively easily out of a little TTL board and also a little signal diode. And I make a lot of these actually. I like to have the safety of that Yapu telemetry script on my radio to show me when I've got 3D locks and things like that. Even if I'm flying FPV, because the GPS has to be locked and all that information has to be kind of ready before you fly, the script on the radio lets me know when she's got a home lock and all that kind of goodness. So I use them a lot. However, uh, you don't need any of that stuff with the Jumper R8. If you just simply plug in the two wires, the receive and transmit, coming out to the telemetry port, set it up as you would do normally for the telemetry stuff into the converter. So protocol 10 with a board rate of 57600, it just works. Stick the Yapu telemetry script on your radio, I'll put a link down below to my video where I showed how to do that, and you're away. So if you are looking for a receiver, to use with D16 protocol with FreeSky or one of the multi-protocol uh, radios like Jumper or the Radio Master TX16S that I got in recently. Uh, and you love the Pixhawk stuff, but you don't want the mess of doing these little boards to change everything around. The R8 is definitely worth a look from all the playing with that I've been doing here. Now there are a couple of extra telemetry options coming in, in things like Ardu Copter and Ardu Plane for orange cubes, anything that's running the H7 or F7 based processors. So there are other options, but if you just want to be able to very quickly and easily with a receiver, plug it all in, this is going to be the way to do it. Plus with FreeSky now focusing on their Archer receivers, which use the new access protocol and have stopped developing new receivers for the AWCST D16 that me and thousands of other pilots around the world use on a daily basis. It's great to see Jumper stepping up and innovating like this. This should have been something that FR Sky came out with themselves. It's the kind of innovation and cool lateral thinking that they were known for once upon a time. But in summary, if you like things like Pixhawk, if you like things like Ardu Plane, Ardu Copter, and you like to have telemetry down into your radio, but you don't want to buy those extra little things, just get yourself one of these little jumper R8 receivers, plug it in, configure it as I've shown, and away you go. Thank you for watching my video and watching right to the very end. If you want to find out what I'm currently working on, you can follow me on social media by searching for Painless360 in the usual places. If you'd like to become part of the inner circle, then you can become a Patreon. Details are in the description and you get lots of additional benefits. Check out the playlist section on the channel too. I organize all of my videos into playlists and it's called something like Introduction to Author Beginners. All of the content is aimed so that you can start at the very beginning and it teaches you that subject, starting with simple principles and moving up to teach you everything you need to know.